What are you doing? The second she's all right. What do you mean? The family, to see her. That's not for you to do. Get out. Don't you dare tell me what to do. I'm telling you, show some respect. Her family will be here any minute, please. Leave. He was with the body. I don't know why or what he was doing, but he has no cause to do that. I mean, a body has to be treated with respect. The dead can't look after themselves, can they? Their loved ones trust us to do it. I don't know what you expect me to do with this information, Victor. He needs telling. Don't go in the mortuary. Don't go near the bodies. I can't say that to Jimmy Savile. Without concrete evidence, there is nothing we can do. Well, it's wrong. In this book, you wrote about sitting for hours with your mother's dead body. The happiest of my life. She was all mine now, you wrote. Why would you want to possess someone in that way? It's called love, Daniel. Isn't it more that you were finally in control of her rather than she being in control of you? And doesn't that suggest something deeply unhealthy about your attitude to the dead? In my work as a porter, I've comforted the dying, consoled the bereaved. And I've never treated anyone who's gone to meet their maker with anything other than humility and respect. If that's the case, then why have Leeds United fans at Ellen Road been known to taunt their opponents with the chant, Jimmy Savile will fuck you in the morgue? That's a blow below the belt, lad. It's all fucking lies. What are you doing? I've had enough. This has all been one gigantic waste of time. 